Today we will continue the last section, section 5 and section 6. In this section one will introduce the repair request process for both for warranty status or out of warranty status. First for warranty repair process. As you know that if you have already confirmed the issues from the devices which belongs to hardware issue, it means it must be repaired by service center or some other repair shop. So for the warranty repair process, first you need contact after sales person of what's minor get the information of the details of defects and warranty status. Also we already shared the telegram or WeChat and mail ID on our official website. Okay, second if you have more than three devices need to repair please fill them in the defects list and the warranty table is below. So every time I think Roger knows this process better. Many times he requests the warranty repair for the devices. So we will give you this table and you need to fill the information to this table and we will double check and reply you for the action or help information about how to send to repair center and how to create system order on our website. But one thing needs to be mentioned. Suppose you have PSU defects on the device. But you don't want to send the whole device, in that case like the third one P21 did this PSU. You only want to send a single PSU not the whole device. So in this case you should mention the PSU information serial number here, not the whole device. And also the control board, it's the same thing. Because that the whole device is too heavy and the transportation expense is very expensive, it is not good to send the whole device. If you have only one control board a defect, in this case you only need to fill the serial number of control board instead of minus serial number. And also same with the hash board. So the third part. After getting confirmation from technicians, you could ship the defects to the instructed service center. But sometimes maybe some service centers are not available so we will instruct you to the instructed service center. And also you could get the courier information and tracking number which need to be record on rework order. Then the next one. Fill the rework order by below link and also the detailed video tutorial of creating order on system. Ok let's check the video font color equals pound 00 C2D6. So could you see my desk of the video? Yes, yes.
Okay, that's all. Are you all clear about the process? Let's go and you could see also at the end of the video you could also check the repair status on the same link. Next, if your device or any part which are already out of warranty, in this case you could just check the service center information on the website. So here, you could get all the service center's information of what's minor. So you could choose the nearest one. But before sending you'd better contact the service center in advance to talk about the repair expense, or whether the chipset and repair materials are available or not. And next part packing requirement. Please ensure that your packing is well enough to protect the device not damaged from transportation. If you would send a single part for repair, you need refer the document as below. So do you have this document? This document you could check. If you only want to send the single hash boards to service center, whatever you have warranty or not, you should pay attention about the packing requirements. The first is removing the hash boards, it's very easy for you. After removing the hash boards from the housing, so there is an advice on how to pack in and how to protect it from transportation. Also needs to fill the whole box with foam or bubble film. If the packing is not good enough and any damage of transportation, maybe the repair cost will be borne by yourself. Okay, so if you want this document you could contact me on Telegram I will share it to you. Okay, do you have any query about this section? The last one is losing warranty behavior, and you could check which actions will let you lose their warranty. You could check on our website. And also we mentioned that the status of not covered by our product warranty, like damage, labels missing, and improper operation, unauthorized disassembly, and so on. So you could check the details here. Okay, let's continue. The last section, critical issues feedback. Actually, it is very less for us contact this part. In my experience, there's no high failure rate of parts from your farm. But we have other customers face the high failure issue about PSU and control boards. Mostly this is environment issue. Customer also need to pay attention on the high rate issue if the failure rate of any device or part are higher than 3%. Suppose you have a 100 devices but 3 of them have the same issue on control board or PSU or something. We think it should be treated as critical issue. After confirm the critical issues happened. Please contact with us at first time. Also need to check the environment of the farm. Especially on input voltage, temperature, network issue, dust, or humidity. After confirm the issues happen maybe we will require you to provide some more information. Some detailed information about the issue. So let's see what need to be provided. First provide all serial numbers of the 40 parts. Second, how many devices totally in the same batch? We need to know the failure rate, and also we want to check if there has some rules about the issues. The third one, the details of the defects, no power or error code only especially in the PSU issue. So we need to know more details, like the issues occurred when powering on or running after several hours, or several days like this, and also the location of farm, environment temperature and range of the input voltage is it a stable enough and so on also maybe we need to export log files and data is required by us and the last one is there any change during the high failure recurring whether there has rocky operated on devices whether the input voltage is stable enough whether there was something occurred uncommonly before the issues happen Okay, that's all. So for this section, you have any query about the critical issues? That's all our training tutorial. Thank you. Also, if you have any query on the issues, on the repair process, or other good suggestions and advices, you could contact us freely. We also have WeChat, Telegram, and also the mail. Thank you.